The world we live in makes up a minuscule fraction of what is out there. There are plenty of planets and stars that lie beyond our solar system waiting to be found. So today, here at Unexplained Mysteries, we will be taking a look at three astronomical discoveries. Radio signals from distant stars suggest hidden planets. Our universe is filled with wonderful things, from galaxies, stars and planets to the smallest signals and frequencies, which, if we can pick up on them, whisper to us that these celestial bodies are there, hidden away, just out of reach. In October of 2021, a research paper was published in the scientific journal Nature Astronomy, which detailed the work of Dr. Benjamin Pope from the University of Queensland, based in Australia and a research team at the Dutch National Observatory, Astron, who took to searching the skies for unknown planets. Astron oversees two observatories in the Netherlands, which means they also manage two of the greatest radio telescopes we have available today. The Westerbork Synthesis Radio Telescope and LOFAR LOFAR has earned itself the title of the world's most powerful radio telescope and was utilized throughout this research. The team were able to detect radio waves that were being emitted from distant stars, which they believe could signal the presence of other planets we are yet to uncover. The team traced the signals of 19 dwarf stars throughout this research and believe that for four of these radio signals, the most viable option to explain their presence is that they have planets orbiting them, much like in our solar system, how Earth and the other planets alongside us orbit the Sun. Dr. Pope has said that this research could potentially lead to the discovery of planets throughout the galaxy. He continued, explaining that this is well established that planets in our own solar system are capable of releasing powerful radio waves. These radio waves are produced by their magnetic fields that are interacting with solar winds. However, while it is true that we have known that planets can produce these radio waves for a while, this research marks the first discovery of them outside of our solar system that could be indicative of exoplanets. Exoplanets refer to any planetary body that is not within our own solar system. Pope and his team narrowed their field of work slightly, focusing solely on red dwarf stars. A red dwarf is the smallest classification of star in the main sequence of a star's life cycle. These star types are the coolest and smallest, have a low luminosity and are the most common star type within the Milky Way galaxy. With 50 of the 60 nearest stars to Earth being red dwarf stars, there was certainly an abundance of this star type to choose from in this research. Perhaps the primary reason that red dwarf stars were used was due to their intense magnetic activity, as an increased magnetic activity will likely result in a greater amount of radio emissions and stellar flares all helping the team detect these signals with greater ease. The lead author behind this study was Dr. Joseph Callingham, associated with both Astron and Leiden University, both of which are based in the Netherlands, and he explained that the research team can say with fair confidence that the signals can be traced to the magnetic connection between these dwarf stars and the planets that remain hidden themselves. Callingham likened the relationship and interaction between the potential planets and these stars to that of Jupiter and its moon Io. The next step in this research is to try and confirm that these elusive planets are in fact there, just tucked away out of sight. Observations that have followed this initial research so far have ruled out the possibility of these planets being bigger than Earth. But there could be smaller planets orbiting these red dwarf stars. The LOFAR telescope, whilst it is very powerful, is only able to monitor stars that are up to 165 light-years away, confining its use to somewhat close-by research only. The team has said that the completion of Australia and South Africa's Square Kilometre Array radio telescope, due to be ready for use in 2029, could drive this research much further, allowing them to see further distances than ever before. Of course, this research project had some more surprising finds too, with magnetically inactive stars also appearing within this research. Radio astronomers discover Saturn-sized exoplanets using radio waves. A more recent avenue that is being explored in astrophysics is the search for exoplanets, propelled forth largely by TESS, the Transiting Exoplanet Survey Satellite. 
a space telescope designed for NASA's Explorer program. So far, we know of 5,054 exoplanets, 227 of which have been confirmed by TESS, and an additional 3,852 are waiting for TESS to check them out. While TESS has been monumental to this research, there are other methods being used to track these exoplanets down too. In 2020, an exoplanet was discovered with a mass not too dissimilar to Saturn. It was not the discovery of the exoplanet, nor the star it orbits, however, that caught the attention of astronomers, but rather the way in which it was found. These astronomers used a radio telescope to track the movement of the star this planet orbits through the Milky Way. From this movement, they were able to see that the slight winding path reflected the path of a star whose journey is slightly altered by the gravitational impact of an orbiting exoplanet. This technique is groundbreaking, and while radio telescopes have had plenty of other functions and pivotal roles to play up until now, this 2020 discovery marks the first time this technique, monitoring the movement of the star, has been completed using a radio telescope. The research surrounding exoplanets is fascinating, and it is truly revolutionary if we find alternate techniques and methods that we can make use of whilst conducting these searches of the skies. Astronomers discovered an exoplanet stuck between three suns. Our sun is perfectly happy on its own. It's quite literally the star of the show. However, for some stars out there, this process is not quite so straightforward. In some star systems, there are multiple stars, linked to one another, orbiting each other as exoplanets orbit them, with their center of gravity being stuck between the two stars, both sharing the same one. When these systems occur, with two stars orbiting one another, these are known as binary star systems. In 2019, however, this went a step further, as one exoplanet out there seems to be part of a triple star system. As with the names of most exoplanets, it's a striking, easy-to-remember name, LTT 1445AB, and it orbits around what is known as the primary star within this triple star system. The system LTT 1445 sits approximately 22.5 light-years away from Earth and is made up of three red dwarf stars. Jennifer Winters, an astronomer at the Harvard-Smithsonian Center for Astrophysics, said, If you're standing on the surface of that planet, there are three suns in the sky, but two of them are pretty far away and small-looking. The primary star is what would resemble our sun in the sky, with two other smaller suns being the other red dwarf stars within the system. It was TESS that made the discovery. TESS is designed to search for exoplanets and does so by looking for them passing between Earth and the star that they orbit. The idea is that as the planet moves in front of its star, a small fraction of the light from the star will be blocked, resulting in a temporary dimming of the star. This dimmed light can therefore alert us to the presence of an exoplanet. What's more, the slight movements of the star and the degree to which the star is dimmed can be influenced by the gravity on the planet itself. This provides a vital insight into some characteristics of the exoplanet, allowing researchers to place it into a rough category regarding the size and weight of the planet, all from just the slightly dimmer light. LTT 1445AB is not the only exoplanet to have been discovered with three suns. Another was found in 2016. However, there are some more exciting differences with this newer 2019 discovery. This exoplanet is 1.35 times the size of Earth, yet is 8.4 times the mass, making it far denser. Despite these characteristics placing it quite confidently into the rocky planetary category, it's unlikely that there would be life on this planet. For LTT 1445AB, one year is just 5.36 days here on Earth. This unusual planet is certainly exciting, and researchers hope to explore it further. It has promising research applications to trial detection tools, and in 2019, scientists did plan for it to be looked at again following the launch, following the launch of the James Webb Space Telescope, which made it to the skies in late 2021. But what do you make of these incredible discoveries? 
Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comments section below and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.